In this video, we will show you how to use Lightroom with Arums. First, open Adobe Lightroom and load your photo catalog. Select the images you want to retouch, then go to the File menu and click Export. In the Export Settings window, set the necessary parameters. Under Export Location, choose Export to Retouch for Me Arums. Make sure to save the files in the same folder as the original photos, and you can also create a subfolder named Lightroom Export to keep things organized. Additionally, check the option to add the exported images to the catalog. Set the image format to TIFF, then click Export. Once the export is complete, Arms will automatically launch with your photo catalog. Now it's time to apply the retouching. Select the required plugins and click Export with Correction. In the Export settings, specify that the files should be saved in the Original Files folder. To prevent duplication, choose the option Keep Original Name and Overwrite if Matching. The format should remain TIFF, but with layers enabled. Click Export and Arums will process your images. Once the processing is complete, your catalog will contain the original photos and the retouched TIFF files created by Arums. If additional editing is required, you can open the images in Photoshop. Simply select the files, right-click, and choose Edit In. Then, select Edit in Adobe Photoshop, followed by Edit Original and Edit. In Photoshop, the retouching will be available as separate layers, allowing you to make further adjustments if needed. Next, let's export the retouched images to JPEG. Open the File menu again and select Export. In the Export settings, set the destination to your hard drive. Rename the Export subfolder and disable the Add to this Catalog option. Choose JPEG as the image format and set the quality to 95. If you're exporting images for social media, adjust the size accordingly. Select the Resize to Fit option, set it to Long Edge, and enter 1 cell in 1600 pixels. To optimize sharpness for screens, enable Sharpen 4 screen and set the sharpening amount to Standard. You can also add a watermark if needed. In the Export settings, click Watermark and select Edit Watermarks. Here you can add a text-based copyright or use an image watermark. Click Graphic or Choose. Select the image file for your watermark and adjust its transparency, margins, and size. Save the watermark settings and give it a name for future use. Once everything is set, click Export and wait for the process to complete. Now you know how to retouch entire catalogs using Arabs. We hope this tutorial was helpful to you. If it was, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the next one.